hello my beautiful people you are welcome to my channel how are you guys doing i hope you are doing well there is a video i would like to show you today before i will go to the video i will be asking for a favor please support your girl hit the subscribe button that is that red button just hit it then you will see a bell touch that bell that bell stand for notification bell anytime i post a video you will be notified Please, I need this favor from you. Support me. I want to be doing live video on this YouTube. Please, just support your girl. As you support me, so shall God support you. God will send you a helper that will support you when you need that help. Today's video is about this video that is going viral. Maybe you have watched it or maybe not. A lady went to see a doctor for her to have the boss. Now they are no longer using uh, operation like adding something instead of making surgery. They are now using machine to pump it out so that it will be big. So they can show it off in Facebook, Instagram. People will say, oh, they have big boss. I said, what are they doing this for? What is the reason they are doing it? How will you go and be using machine to bring out your boss so that he will be big? when the infection will come when the problem will come how are you going to solve it before they were using operation using different surgery to have it but now they are no longer using it they use machine it's like they are like telling god that god did not create them well but god created each and every one of us in his own image and likeness god created you and see everything about you is perfect why are you decide to turn it the other way? To tell God you don't know which, not beside the one time. Why are you doing that? For you to have more lover or for you to, to be popular? Some of them will go and be doing their hip. Their hip for them to have big hip. Why some will be using unnecessary cream for them to peel up all their skin? For them to be white or for them to have white color because black is not good for them. What is the reason you are doing it? I don't know. But I'm here to talk to you today. Let whatever you have, let it be okay for you. If you, you, are, if you are thinking that what you have is not okay, you are not satisfied with what you have, you will be going different lane to have the taste of what you, you want. But you will not be okay. You will not be satisfied. You will say, okay, I need a big boss. You will go to do one thing or the other for you to have big one. You will say, I need a big hip. You will go and be doing all that thing to have big hip. One after the other, you will, then you will not see that your face is not good. Your teeth is not good. Try to do everything. That is, you are comparing yourself with others. You are telling God that what God has given to you, you are not okay with it. It's a big problem on your own. People is not looking, down, looking at that. Any man that wants to love you is not looking at that because you have shape, because you have this. Now, nah, the man is not looking for one most beautiful, uh, one most big boss or big breast. No, they look at character. They look at what can you give. What is this side you that you can break out? That is what men are looking for. Not the phys physical appearance. Appearance that is not, is not natural. As I, I can stand from my head to the feet of my toes. Everything about me is natural. I don't have any catafic for me to have big breasts or big boss. I don't have it on me. But I still find a man that loves me, a man that cares for me, a man that really knows what is called love. I'm a married woman. It's not because of that that man will love you or men will be rushing after you. Why are you doing that? We are not talking about the price or the money, but we are talking about telling God that you don't know what he's doing. You are not appreciating what God gave to you. You are not appreciating the time that God put in, that effort that God put in for you to be a perfect person. If you appreciate Him, you will, I will not see any reason you using another means to make, to change Him. 
Look at the other girl that day. He went to do operation on her, on her hip for her to have big hip, for her to be walking like this, doing that the people will be seeing her big hip. After the, the your surgery, the hip become big and big. Not just big, a little big to that extent that he cannot even stand with the bust, with the hip. We do still was successful. He will go to Instagram and start moving it around. People will say, oh, look at one big bust. Look at this lady now. You can see the picture here. Because of what? Going to use machine to bring out your, your, your boss. My dear, I'm here to advise you guys. It's my opinion. You might take it or you might dislike it. Please stop using one operation, one surgery, one thing to change what God has given to you, what God has created. If you are saying that you are not satisfied with your breast, the moment you finish that the operation of your breast, you will see another thing that you will say, oh, this is making me to be inferior. You try to do it again. That is, everything about you will become artificial. When the disadvantage will come, you will not be able to stand it. I am begging you, guests especially, Anything you have, let it be okay for you. Do you have big breasts? Do you have small one? Do you have big boss? Do you have a little? Let it be okay for you. Value whatever you are. Respect whatever you are. Anybody coming, anyone seeing you, we value it and respect it for you. Here is my little video. Please share this video. Give me a thumbs up if you love what I'm doing. And do not forget to support me. Subscribe to this channel. See you in my next video. Bye-bye.